Hey everyone, planning to have a kid? Well, you know, at Koan Nutrition, I'm the chief nutritionist and uh, we have different packages. And one package that I'm very, very proud of is the New Life Package. New Life Packages is when you're an expecting mother and or before you conceive, both father and mother, how you should eat. Now, I get a lot of people who say that they want to have only one kid or two kids and that's the way the world is going today. But people are still smoking, drinking and doing whatever they want before they conceive that offspring. And I work with children and I work with children who are autistic, Down syndrome, ADHD. These are, these are situations where children are dull, children are handicapped, children are mentally challenged. And you know, the, the fact of the matter is, could it be something that you've eaten? So I want to make this video uh, about uh, obese mothers and obese fathers. People are not taking care of their weight before they conceive. Now, you may say to me that, well, Ryan, you're the nutritionist and you have a nutrition clinic, so it's in your vested interest to convince people to take a nutrition plan. Our old times, people don't do this. They eat food for two people. If you are big, if you are fat, one thing I want to show you today, in science news, okay, this is December 23rd, 2019, they have said mom's obesity in pregnancy is linked to lag in son's development and IQ. Lag ka matlab, there is a slow development of the child. When I read this article this last week, I said I need to explain to people that if you are a fat mother, your responsibility is to first get your nutrition and your exercise in place before you decide to bring a child into the world. Because no amount of IIT, JE tuitions later on or money that you invest in Baiju apps is going to help you. You have to learn first to eat correctly, get your BMI in place, get your husband in shape because even the man's DNA, the sperm transfer holds DNA, the software code gets influenced by your eating and your exercise. So the less stress, the better organic food, the better weight, the better blood chemistry in you is going to be better. They actually put it out over here, okay? At age seven, they measured the children and found that the boys whose mothers were overweight or obese in pregnancy had scores five or more lower points on a full IQ test. So, food for thought. Is your obesity going to be the reason why your child is less, is less gifted? Food for thought. Call us at Koan Nutrition because we are the best nutrition clinic on the planet. And we design the plans based on your culture, based on your blood test, based on your lifestyle, based on your genetics. And then we teach you how to eat. And yeah, plan about a year in advance before your pregnancy to lose weight. And do the weight loss, not the Google way, or not any sort of uh, fat diet, because that's going to affect your DNA. You need to know that you need to preserve your muscle and drop your fat. In fact, we've had cases where women do strict dieting, they don't feed themselves. So imagine when your egg is being produced and your sperm in fertilization, the nutrition is low because you're in a diet. So you want to be on a nutrition plan where the calorie is low, but the micronutrients and the macros are carefully balanced such that you're optimizing your nutrition. So by chance, if you and your husband conceive during a diet plan, you're not in negative paucity zone. Food for thought, Kwan Nutrition, pick up the phone, call us up on this number, 9743430000 or google up www.kwanutrition.com. Trust me, the investment in a one-year nutrition plan done for your child is the best investment you will ever make towards your future unborn child.